Hello children. Let's learn to use the tables. One day a lot of fruits had grown in Chanda's garden. She thought, why not take four bananas each for her friends Appu, Golu and Babban? Children, can you tell how many bananas should Chanda take? Appu, Golu and Babban are how many friends in total? Three. Now, how many bananas are to be taken for each friend? Four. Chanda has to take four bananas each for three friends. We can write it like this. Three times four bananas. Now, how will we write it in the form of multiplication? Three multiplied by four. Children, can you write its answer by using the table of four? Absolutely right. Chanda will have to take 12 bananas for her three friends. Chanda filled 12 bananas in a basket and she started walking in her garden. Chanda collected a lot of mangoes from her mango tree and tied them in bunches of six mangoes each. Chanda now has eight such bunches. Can you tell how many mangoes has Chanda collected in total? Chanda has got eight bunches and every bunch has six mangoes in it. How will we write this? Eight times six. Now, how will we write it as multiplication? 8 multiplied by 6. Now, using the table of 6, they become 48. Chanda collected a total of 48 mangoes. Now, Chanda had to pick coconuts from a coconut tree. But the tree was very high. Therefore, she called Babban for help. Babban told Chanda that he would take 5 rupees for picking each coconut. Chanda had to get a total of 7 coconuts picked. Now Chanda is thinking how much money will she have to pay to Babban. Children, you have solved this correctly. Chanda will have to give 35 rupees to Babban. Chanda collected the coconuts and gave money to Babban. Now both of them went to rest under a tree. Children, in this lesson, we learned to use tables.